Right now, once cut out her armhole, remember please, if you've not watched the video on the puff sleeve and the jacket sleeve, try to do that, because that's what you fit into the armhole point. From that video, we've been told we're using an estimated back, or let me just say it now, we're using a cross back 15 inches, or shoulder, as some people will call it, or back 15 inches. So for you to get your back, you divide by two. Remember, we are assuming this is our fabric because I'm just going to be cutting it on this brown paper. This is our fabric, and your fabric will be in two fold for the front panel. This will be the folded end. It will be this way, and this open end will be this way, your fabric. So, as it's this way right now, you want to cut out your armhole. What you just need to cut out your armhole is your shoulder measurements, then your round armhole. So the shoulder is 15. 15, you divide by two. To get your back measurement, you divide your shoulder measurement by two or across that. So that will give us seven and a half. Seven and a half, I'll add half in sewing allowance. That's eight. So you've just got it eight at this point. Now, our round half hole from our previous videos has been 18. What do you do? You just divide that 18 by two and that will give you nine. So you just take your tape rule this way get nine on that same point that you've gotten nine then you rule it so achieving your ham hole is pretty easy just come here like this up to this six inches just create a curve here and I'll take half inch away please just be careful and listen to this I don't want the arm hole actually this is what I want to achieve but remember when you're cutting when you're truly cutting your front panel and your back panel you still place them together and shape the arm hole when you're when you sew the back and front arm hole together so Remember when you've sewn the front and the back panel of your top or dress together, you still shape. So to be on the safer side that the ammo will not be too inside because I will actually want to achieve this inside. So let me just take this half inch this way. Let me just take this half inch this way. Then just place my tape rule here. This is inch, six inches. For me, I just get a curve, a C curve, and I'm good to go. Your ham hole is ready. You just take your scissors. Remember, when you're sewing, you still make sure that you arrive at this point. But for safety purposes, you just want to arrive at this little point here. ready you can see that's just an easy way of arriving at your ham hole it's pretty easy remember fast central fashion school is still on when you come on board you learn lots and lots of things you can never imagine and you become a guru just in a couple of weeks or months and you're great so look forward to seeing you next time have a lovely day